in Destroy the Enemy News, submitted by Jojo Nomo. Oh, hero. <laughs> a 70 year old woman went through two rounds of Hitman to get revenge. Holy oh, shit. Uh, I don't know why I pictured an old lady. That was weird. A 70 year old. Oh. That's literally what she said. <laughs> That's literally. I don't know why I pictured two Hitmen either. Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm picturing Hitman. Why? <laughs> like two, two times though. I, I, I pictured two senior Hitmen too, because like they're her, her homies. They're like old mob guys. They got the ski masks on. And then, but then it's like the oxygen tank is like. <laughs> yeah. So the 70 year old woman. Her name is Linda. Linda. From Salt Lake City, Utah. This is what she looks like. Oh, my gosh, oh she you so old, like sweet. She looks, uh, she she looks, looks like a she bitch. She looks like sweet. a bitch to me. She, she looks like so that nice. lady that fucking no. She'd like be measuring like if your lemon tree is growing over her. Yep. She'd be like, what the fuck? <laughs> she That's looks like she my looks third like. grade That's teacher that shot. kicked me out of school. Her She's haircut bad. is not very friendly. She's, She's wearing a sweater. Come on. Doesn't have the curls. No, yeah. she doesn't look seventy. She's she looks like maybe in her fifties. No. Seventy? My mom is in her sixties, like dude. Mom's age yeah, right now. Like, That's seventy. My mom is sixty. When you get the labia neck, you're like seventy. Because <laughs> when I picture 70s, okay. I picture yeah. like a... The meat like curtains a, down here? Yeah. Like a bulldog. <laughs> For 70? I think you're thinking like 80 or 90. Yeah, you're thinking 80. Okay. So she was found guilty of conspiring to have her ex-husband killed. Damn. And they're divorced already? Let me tell you, this shit is kind of funny in my opinion. She contacted this one guy, right? To find... Like this guy was supposed to find someone to kill her ex-husband. And she even said like, you know what? If he kills the new wife too, then I wouldn't care either. Fuck it. So, she shot two people killed. And she promised the sum of $25,000 total. That's not oh. a lot of money. So it would be 5,000 down payment, $7,000 diamond ring, and 18,000 from the victim's life insurance policy. Wow. Which she would collect after his death. Mm -hmm. And so, but then that dude that that she approached, he he just felt so guilty that he approached the police instead. What kind of hitman is this? Maybe he just started. Yeah, it was his first job. <laughs> he was supposed to be finding the hitman. Oh, he's a hitman a agent. A headhunter for a hitman. Yeah, so his name is Christian. And so... Christian? <laughs> the most pure name. Yeah. Yeah, so she was trying to get someone or... He wasn't a professional. This this sounds like a comedy movie though. Yeah, I know. This is a Coen Brothers film. This is Fargo oh, meets... I haven't even told you the best part yet. Anyway, so she was trying to get Christian to make it look like an accident or a break and gone wrong. Anyway, Christian went to the police and he also went to the ex-husband to let him know about everything that was happening. Oh my god. So then Christian, <laughs> he wore a wire and then got evidence that she wanted him dead. So she goes to jail. Then when she's in jail, she meets this inmate and she tells this inmate like, all right, I'm gonna pay for your bill. You gotta find me someone to kill Christian because he was supposed to kill my ex-husband. Oh, <laughs> you gotta kill two people. Oh then fuck. She ends up paying for the bail and, and then she gives her lawyer a letter, pretty much like instructing how like she wants Christian to be killed, but then the, the lawyer. lawyer. Well, the lawyer was supposed to hand off the letter, but I don't know if the lawyer knew. Who's this like, fucking Saul Goodman or whatever that fool's name is? Yeah. Like <laughs> the the call yeah. 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 So then the illegal lawyer. She handed her lawyer a check for one hundred and fifty-five thousand dollars issued to oh shit the inmate that she bailed out. Oh shit. Damn, I'm spending so much money for being so angry. That's yeah. a lot of money. When you hate someone, you gotta get rid of them. I misstated what the letter was. It was a confess letter that she wanted to have Christian sign so then it would just absolve everything. Like, pretty much him saying that he made everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was what the letter was. So he has to admit to that and he's gonna get murdered. What a bitch. She just does not let go. <laughs> no, she <laughs> doesn't have good plans either. At all. She was asking the former inmate to make sure that the hitman was willing to kill Christian and like the ex-husband, but yeah, so the police in the jail They confiscated the letter from the lawyer and so they never got to the former inmate But she got caught trying to get two hitmen. I feel like she like lives in her own her own world or her own movie Like in her mind she's like I want you to kill my husband and I want you to kill the ex the other hitman and everyone else in that same like, world is like uh, <laughs> lady uh, uh, I don't I don't know uh, 
police. <laughs> they're not even. They're not even criminal. Yeah, like, yeah they're not. Like, like, you look <laughs> like a kind of guy that likes hitmen. <laughs> she's like in her own action star in her own movie. Yeah, yeah. yeah. no one knows like yeah. this. Yeah. Looking for a job. <laughs> Why are you talking to me with your back face towards yeah. me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because then like. The, the fuck is wrong with you, bitch? <laughs> yeah. She was trying to get that the second hitman to also kill this other lawyer that was what? suing her. What? Oh <laughs> She's crazy. God. Suing her. So she was trying to kill the lawyer that was suing her, the hitman that was the first hitman, and then her oh, ex-husband yeah. and yeah. ex-husband's new wife. And where does she have all this money? Yeah, she's like a bad guy in a lair, like, you'll see, you'll all see. <laughs> <laughs> you'll be dead, and you'll be dead. <laughs> Conspiring all that. I wonder, she does look like a villain though. Like a <laughs> diabolical villain. Right? Like, I wonder how many years she's got away with doing that. Like, how many people has she paid off? Like, she's just writing checks left and right. <laughs> you fuck me, you fuck me, and you fuck me. I want to look at her Venmo transactions, and it's like all two fucking villains and shit. It's like a knife <laughs> and a fucking gun. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> no, this lady's just trying to kill anyone that causes her problems. Yeah. You think she's been saving up? Like, this is her retirement fund? Like, she's been, like, waiting? Yeah, yeah. She's all, like, <laughs> in her 30s, like, you fucking bitch, I'm gonna get she, you. She, like, keeps a list. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like a grocer in a store that gave her the wrong change. Right? She's like, <laughs> you'll see. <laughs> you'll see. <laughs> Finally, for her retirement, instead of going on vacation and going on a cruise like most old people, she's yeah. gonna start murder her. spree. <laughs> I know, this is like living her dreams, crazy. living her best life. Dude, her behavior is like like a fucking hot girl that like just realized that she's no longer hot. So she's just like, <laughs> fuck, what else do I use now? I'm gonna just kill people. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> fucking grudge holding ass bitch. I know, and it's funny because in this article they're like, well, her sentencing has been scheduled for April 23rd. She faces life in prison, but you know, there's still time to kill everyone else and then she could get out free. That's funny. Now to April 23rd. Well, she's only in prison for that long? No, that's when her sentencing is gonna oh, happen. Oh, I was like, that's only a month? So she has she a month to kill everyone yeah. so she can get So out. she's out right now, she's free. No, she's in jail. Oh, she's it's in a jail. joke. Uh, <laughs> oh. Gotcha. Yeah, it was just a joke, like, you know, she has a month. Gotcha. Okay, it's not funny anymore. <laughs> I thought it was funny when I read it in the article. Yeah. Anyway. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Bart. <laughs> What kind of a bitch do you have to be to hold a grudge that hard and that long and like for that many people? It's a, like a gambling addict. Like she didn't win the first time, so she's yeah. like, I, I can win the second one. And then it, she keeps losing money. and losing. She's like, I'm gonna kill more people, you know? And like, one of these is gonna hit. Yeah, so she she's she, she wants to kill her husband, and then the guy that hires she hires to kill her husband fails, so she wants to kill that guy. Yeah. And either one that fails. And the, lo the random lawyer, like, what the fuck is going on? It's like she has to make up for all the losses, so she's like, I'm yeah. just gonna add more to the list. That's a lot of money. That's like a total of like 200 grand that she promised already. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, at that age, you should just let go and like, Chill. I kind of want to kill Christian too, though, for being a bad criminal. Well, she should have. She should have offered a hundred thousand the first time, cause she only offered twenty five grand. I think for twenty five grand, I would probably go to the police too. <laughs> like if I was a hitman getting into just say it, no to the know. job. Yeah, just, but now you know too much. But it's on your, it's so on you can your go conscience. down. But yeah. you're a criminal. You're supposed to have a strong conscience. Well, I don't know. If he's he's new. Or he could have been like the guy that acts like the bad boy in the senior citizen home, oh, or the yeah. tough guy. Yeah. Like he always had stories of like back in the day. But he's really a giant pussy. Yeah. yeah. And then <laughs> like he was like the guy that kind of knew stories of yeah. like the Salt Lake City mafia or some shit like that. <laughs> You like the guy that hung out at the bar? Yeah, cause she he's not even a criminal. It's just this dude that has like neck tattoos and she hired him to do some work. Oh, on so her she property. stereotyped him? <laughs> yeah. He's like a mechanic and shit. Yeah, she hired him to do some work on her property he's and like, then that's uh, when she just She's like, You look like a kind of guy that knows murderers. Yeah, how do you strike up that conversation? <laughs> <laughs> and he's all like, uh, for twenty five thousand, I guess I could find someone and he's like Oh, this is wrong. I feel like that's exactly how it went down. <laughs> like honestly, like she you have, stereotype. you know, you know people, right? <laughs> you wear tattoos. Yeah. She's you like this old white lady. You, know. <laughs> you look kind of comfortable murdering people. <laughs> One of those tattoos probably means murder, right? I know. <laughs> yeah, but it didn't turn out too well for her. Now she's facing life in prison. I mean, she's 70, so. Damn, what? she fucked up her little life left. And she's still trying to kill from prison. Yeah. <laughs> what, what did this ex-husband oh do? 
do uh, then? Like, what, is there any story? I don't think he did anything based <laughs> off this crazy bitch. <laughs> yeah. I feel like she caused everything. Wow. <laughs> 70 years of being a bitch, man. How do you even survive? I'm surprised she doesn't have cancer with all that stress. I feel like there's a lady in my apartment just like that. Apartment the, complex. The angry lady? Yeah, the one that like just she's on everybody about their laundry all the time Like she knows all of our laundry baskets by heart. I told her about the one that we have in our place. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know the thing with old people is they're either really fucking grumpy or really fucking chill. Yeah, and it's like there's, there's no, no yeah, there's I no in between whether you had regrets in life That's why you need to just make the right choices and yeah or let the wrong choices go. Yeah, like, yeah. Don't hold on to it. What kind of old people do you guys think you'll be? You know, I was watching. We're watching the news yesterday. I think I'll be Alzheimer's. <laughs> we're watching the news yesterday, and there's I'm this already. guy named Oliver Hurricane Rogers, and he's a hundred, and he just completed like a five or ten k or something like that, and he Whoa. still and he still runs. A hundred? He was like fucking. What does he eat? I don't know, but he wears medals, and he's sitting. He has. He's sitting in his like lazy boy thing with a <laughs> ton of medals. Like the old people lazy boy ones. Yeah, and he was just that. saying like. Everyone should just keep running. <laughs> it was awesome. He was so cute yeah, running. He's like he's like stiff already. He's but hella like, stiff. He's like moving. I bet he was hot when he was younger. Was he was like, attractive. Yeah. He was in the military. Oh my damn, a hundred. <laughs> Shit's crazy. You just tell by the personalities. <laughs>